everybody. Welcome to another 190 North. I'm Janet Davies, and on this show, I will be your tour guide to urban adventures. So first off, we are going to explore Chicago's most delicious and historic delights with Chicago Food Planet Tours. It's a walking tour that allows you to eat through the city's yummiest hoods, and you can learn a few things about food, science, and architecture along the way. Looking to dig into some of Chicago's best cuisine? Then you've got to check out Chicago Food Planet's Neighborhood Food Tours. We call it a food tasting and cultural walking tour, um, but you do eat quite a bit of food, so we ask people to come hungry. You are going to leave quite full by the end. We focus not only on eating and food, but food science and architecture and history and culture, a little something for everyone. Chicago Food Planet treks it on the three-hour Near North Food Tour, where you'll walk in your way through the Gold Coast, Old Town, and Lincoln Park hoods. Now the first stop on the food tour is the Ashkenaz Deli, which has been open since 1973 and it's home to the Reuben. Oh my gosh, there's so much meat on here. Next, Tea Geschwender. You'll leave the cool iced tea for the road, perfect for the next stop where things get a little spicy. We're spice merchants and we've been here at the Old Town location since 2000. If you need the good stuff, you come to the Spice Hall. If the aroma of this shop's premium spices isn't enough, you get to taste them on this tour. You'll sample unique flavors named after Chicago streets like the Lake Shore Spice and Milwaukee Spice. Now another cool shop on the tour is Old Town Oil, which is full of really great balsamic vinegars and olive oils. You are encouraged to come in here, mix, match, and taste. With flavors like white truffle oil and black cherry balsamic, walk away with a delicious vinegar and olive oil mixture created by you. I would have never come across this in a million years, you know. You would have just gone to the local places that you always go to and not travel down these little off-beaten paths. So it turned out pretty neat. Now the sweetest stop on the tour is 47 years old. And we in Chicago, most of us know the fudge pot. But to out-of-towners, what a treat. They get to go back and actually make some of this candy. You'll break into some delicious English toffee while owner David demonstrates this candy-making craft. Then you'll walk down wells to catering chocolate, where you'll taste a selection of fine cheeses and hummus. Don't be bashful, we've got plenty of cheese. And the tour ends big at Pacino's Pizzeria, where you'll enjoy a hearty slice of spinach and cheese stuffed pizza. I would never try broccoli or spinach in the pizza, but it's awesome. For locals and visitors alike, this tour has a slice of something for everyone. I'll hear locals say all the time, oh, we've walked around here a million times, but we never knew that's what this was or that's what this meant. To not only learn about the city, but to get to meet see people in stores and stuff, so it's, it's a great idea. And you're learning we, we already told somebody about it in Sarasota, and they're doing this uh, in two weeks. Now, what's the tab for all this? only $42, and you can catch a tour every day, April through November. I loved it. It was a great way to sample some tasty food.